hi guys and welcome back to my channel my name is kathy of kathy's cash and coin i'm a single mom with three daughters although my oldest is grown and out of the house my middle daughter is now a college student but she is home for the summer and then i have my youngest that lives here with me in our home thank you so much for stopping by and checking out this video this is a totally different video for me i'm doing a full voiceover while i set up my budget planner for my next budget with me i was tagged by jenny at simply living saves to do uh 40 questions about me and so i decided this is how i was going to do it first i have a little uh, post-it note in here so that i remind myself to add butcher box to the budget for this paycheck so i'm going to do that first and then we'll get into these questions so the first question is do you have any pets we do we have a cat um i've talked about him a lot we lost him over the winter for a couple months and he's back home his name is king t'challa and then we also have three fish they are convict cichlids and i will try and snap a picture of them some of them are quite large and then we have two turtles red-eared sliders are you in a relationship i am not and i am not currently looking and we'll just leave it at that uh, do you drink alcohol? Yes, I do, but not very often. Um, my brother-in-law, who lives in Michigan, where I will be going 4th of July weekend, likes to make a drink um, that he named The Vacation. And it is delicious. I will partake in that for sure. So my next drink will be just in a couple weeks. Uh, next question is, do you believe in God? I do. Um, I was raised by an ordained minister and an Irish Catholic, so it was an interesting mix. Um, my mom is an ordained minister and my dad is, you know, a typical Irish Catholic. So, yeah, they, uh, they're an interesting mix together. <laughs> and next question is hot dog or cheeseburger? I would say cheeseburger. I'm pretty sure I would pick a cheeseburger. My favorite food, I'm a meat and potatoes kind of person, so I would say like steak and mashed potatoes or baked potato with, you know, like a loaded baked potato. Oh yeah, that sounds delicious right now. All right, if you see here, I am switching to my, um, it's the transaction log, but I actually turn it into the uh, tracker for my revolving binder. So I wipe that out and then fill in all the categories for my revolving binder. All right, uh, next question is, what do you drink in the, oh, I'm sorry, yeah, favorite food I got, yeah, what do you drink in the morning? I drink coffee, bulletproof coffee, I've talked about that before on my channel, that is coffee that where you add butter, yes, butter to it, and I add butter, and I add usually protein powder, and also MCT oil, it is my energy in the morning, fills me up, and that's all I need. Um, can you do 100 push-ups? Nope. I've never been able to do one push-up. So doing 100, yeah, no. I've never been able to do a chin-up, pull-up. Yeah, nope, not for me. My favorite season. Um, well, my youngest daughter's name is Autumn, so I'm going to go with Autumn. Um, definitely love fall, the, the changing leaves and everything. It's gorgeous. We live in the Midwest, so, so um, fall is just absolutely stunning. Autumn, yes. Uh, my favorite hobby right now, I would say it is gardening. I have really enjoyed having my own um, property to plant and figure out how to do certain things and try different flowers in different areas. And um, I'm looking forward to that, to be able to do this every year now. So yeah, I'm gonna say gardening. Do you have tattoos? Yes, I have a couple tattoos. Well, I had two tattoos, and one was just an outline of a heart, and one was my own name. Um, the outline of a heart, when I turned 18, um, I went and got fixed because it was they were homemade tattoos. So I had them fixed professionally, and then one of my name I actually had removed. And let me tell you, having a tattoo removed was more painful than getting the actual tattoo. Um, yeah all right so i have finished with the revolving binder and moving on to my sinking fund sheets so i do outline all of them so it's easier to see on camera um someone did ask me to do that once but uh, these are all copies i made a ton of copies at one point so i just um go over the them and make them darker so they're easier to see all right the next question is do you wear glasses? I do. Um, I have glasses for distance, but I am finding I might need reading glasses now too, so I might have to get some bifocals. Yay! How exciting! <laughs> um, do you have any phobias or fears? 
not really like i don't like bugs or um like little critters and stuff like that but i'm not really af afraid of them i just think they're gross and as a single mom i've always had to just be the one to take care of them so um i would say my biggest fear would be anything you know involving my family or my children something happening to them that's probably my biggest fear um do you have a nickname well kathy is my nickname my full name is Catherine. um but i've always been called cat or um i'm trying to think of other nicknames you know red all different things that have to do with my red hair for sure uh what is my favorite candy reese's yeah reese's can't go wrong with peanut butter and chocolate sorry it's just the best do you believe in ghosts i do um not that i've seen them or have any proof but i do uh rain or snow i have to say i'm gonna say snow um, only because I work outside and snow is much easier to wipe off once you get wet out in when you work outside in the rain and if it's cold oh that's the worst the cold rain is absolutely 100% the worst um, do you have any piercings just my ears only my ears um, what is my age I am 43 years old french fries or onion rings I'm gonna say french fries yeah french fries I would go with french fries do you have any children? I do. I have three daughters, as I said in the beginning. Yes, I have three daughters, aged 27. Yeah, my, my oldest is 27. So if you do the math, I was pretty young when I had her. Then uh, Ari is uh, 18. She'll be 19 in November. And then Audie is 11. All right. What is your favorite color? Well, gee, anyone watching knows, and it is green. I like forest green is my favorite color. It's like a deep forest green so pretty to me can i sing no um no i don't sing <laughs> can you whistle i can whistle just a basic whistle i can't do the you know fingers in your mouth kind of whistle uh where where was i born i was born in illinois born and raised in illinois uh, still in illinois <laughs> uh, do i have any siblings i sure do my parents uh together have six kids so i have five siblings with my mom and my dad and then my dad also has three other children so yeah there are nine of us <laughs> okay next question is can you cook yes i can cook do i cook uh not very often i tend to overcook or not overcook food but cook too much food is what i'm trying to say um and then it goes to waste and that could be partly growing up in a big family we always had huge meals to feed everyone um so i'm working on that i used to cook and bring some of it over to my sister and my brother-in-law and i talked to my sister i might start doing that again because i do love to cook and try different meals and um, meal prep and all of that i just have not been into it too much lately so hopefully i'll get back into that all right next question is can you swim yes i can swim i don't swim very often um, I have sensitive skin, so I don't like uh, the water on my skin, the chlorine, all of that. Autumn is probably a better swimmer than me, though. She does swim team, and um, she's just, she's an excellent swimmer. So, but yes, I know how to swim. I just don't like to swim. <laughs> um, next question, shower or bath? Same thing. Um, I take a shower. I don't like to sit in the water um, because my skin is so sensitive and sitting in for that long is just yeah not um not fun for me my skin just gets irritated so i don't do hot tubs too often if i do it would be a super quick one yeah so just a shower um city or nature i'm gonna say for sure nature uh, i do not like the city i grew up one town outside of the city and i just don't like it it's just too busy just finding parking and everything about it um i moved far enough away that it's you know it's definitely still suburban not rural but um but i'm close enough to the city that i have access to everything that i need so i don't go into like the downtown area ever very rarely um am i a good friend i try to be i hope i am um, sometimes it's hard with people, you know, uh, life just gets in the way, life gets busy, and um, if people get offended that, you know, we don't stay in touch or something, then that's, I don't think that's my, my problem, that doesn't make me a bad friend, it's just is life getting in the way, at least that's my thoughts on it. Um, have you broken any bones? No, 
I should knock on some wood. I have never broken a bone, so I am super grateful for that. Uh, how many TVs do you own? We have one TV. Um, we had two in the apartment. We had a small TV in the girls' room, and I don't think we, I think we might have gotten rid of that. I don't think we brought it to our house because we never even turned it on. We never connected it to cable, Wi-Fi, anything. I don't think it was a smart TV, though. Um, so we have one TV in the living room, and that's it. The girls watch and stream things on there. I rarely watch it, but I bought that. I actually bought that TV for myself for my birthday a few years ago, um, just because my TV was so old and I wanted a smart TV and bought it for myself. So, um, but my kids enjoy it. <laughs> um, what was your worst pain ever? I'm gonna probably say childbirth, but shin splints have to be a close second. Yeah. Shin, oh, I had shin splints in both of my shins at the same time, and walking was, uh, it was excruciating. It felt like my shins were on fire. That was pretty bad, but of course, um, childbirth was pretty high up there too. <laughs> um, do you like to dance? I love to dance. Um, you know, dance with my kids in the kitchen or at a wedding or whatever. We have a good time. We, we try to. You know, um, there's been many kitchen dances in my family. Um, at my parents' house, too, growing up, I remember us just being goofy and dancing in the kitchen, too. So, yeah, sounds like fun. It is fun. All right, next question is camping or hotel? I am going to say hotel. I do not want to be camping and have, you know, any bug crawling on me while I'm sleeping or... Yeah, no, actually, as I'm recording this, I'm in a hotel room um, at a uh, union convention. So kind of funny that that question's in here. All right, moving on to do you think you are weird? Yes, I'm weird. I think everybody's weird in some certain way. I think that's normal. <laughs> All right, next question. How long have you been gardening? I would say I've been gardening since I was a child. Um... So my mom worked on Sunday, so she always worked on Mother's Day. And then I have cousins whose mom uh, passed away when they were young. So my aunt, um, their their mother passed away. So her sister, their mother, said my, my other aunt would take us on Mother's Day to go pick out flowers at the nursery and plant flowers in her garden. And we did that for many Mother's Days. So I think that's where I got my love for um, flower gardening. I haven't really gotten into vegetable gardening or doing any um, vegetables or fruits, um, but I would say yes, I've been at least doing that since I was a child. All right, what is one thing you would like to grow in your garden? I think I would like to try and do some herbs, have an herb garden. That would be nice. Um, but right now I'm just focused on the few that I planted this year um, and learning how to take care of the ones that are uh, perennials that are already there. I have um, a few things that I just need to learn how to care for. What is my growing zone? My growing zone is five. I am a five. So that's it. That's all the questions. And I want to tag a few people. So I am going to tag my friend Gina, Gina Renee, RN Budgets. I am going to tag Janessa, also known as Mama T, here on YouTube. I am going to tag Brittany from Plan Your One Life and Tasha from Mind Your Money. And I'm going to tag my friend Mrs. V. I think it would be really fun to see you guys answer some of these questions. And of course, you don't have to answer all of them if you don't feel comfortable. Um, I appreciate Jenny for tagging me and letting me um, be a part of this. I apologize as I'm seeing the recording that I didn't have my watch on. So you get to see my fun uh, tan line from um, my watch and I don't have my ring on. So this is me just raw and just setting up my budget for the week. And, um, hopefully I will have my budget with me up soon. So you guys could check that out. You guys take care and have a blessed day. Bye.